This is the remains of an old church called uh, Tanis Gabes. And uh, all the walls have been robbed away. And then you can just see, I don't know if you can see it through the trees there. That's the uh, entrance for the road would have gone through on the other side. It's pretty cool. I've actually got permission to uh, detect in the woodland around the church. Obviously not in the church walls. But yeah, I've not actually been here detecting it. Let's get a closer look at those graves. So here you can see some of the graves in the overgrowth. Some more there as well. Quite a lot of them actually. There's one grave here somewhere where the person's either 104 or 105 years old. Which is quite cool. They were born in like 1750. Can't remember where the grave is. It's very eerie down here. That noise you can hear is the dog chewing on branches and stuff. But yeah, the graves go all the way down over there. It's a very interesting place. I'd love to do some research because I've probably got family here. But yeah, it's very cool. Um, I'm thinking maybe doing um, a, a short documentary about this place. So uh, if you're interested in that, give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment saying yes. So I'm around the I think it's the front of the church here. Just about to leave. Very eerie feeling. It's even more eerie when you come here in the evening when it's starting to get dark in the summertime and all the trees are all in full leaf. Right here. Very eerie feeling. So here's the exit entrance. You can actually still see where the road is. So down that way. At the end of the road, the gates are still there. 